Andrew Lessman. Take a look, free shipping on all Andrew Lessman and special pricing as well. So maybe this is your time to stock up. Maybe you're trying something new, but this expires at the end of the day today. So maybe right now while you're shopping with us, head over 804. 658 is coming up here. Oh, it's Tina. <laughs> Sometimes I can see Tina before we can see her, and I see her over there. Uh, I know. I wish everybody knew that you could see me like three seconds before everybody at home saw me, and I'm like, yeah. doing something weird. Well, there you go. I'm trying that, to that's it. That's psych it. out I mean, my she, you, she does. You do that on air anyway, so everyone, everyone gets to see it's it. It's true. Did you see what I just did? Yeah, very Boom. good. Boom. Look at that. I have an umbrella. Can I, Chad, do you know, here just because I want to talk to you. Who invented the original umbrella? Do we know that information? I feel Thomas like we should Google it. Edison. Edison. No, I'm Is that? No, that oh. was like the light bulb. <laughs> I just believe Chad Allen. Um, you want to know why? Is because I don't want to like, you know, poo-poo on the original umbrella. Right. I'm sure they're, they're not around anymore. But think <laughs> about this. Umbrellas are a necessity, right? Yep. Now it's 2023. And the original umbrella, what did we all do, right? Oh. You went out, right? The rain was, was on there. Yeah. If you wanted to get in the car, <laughs> go inside, right? Yep. You would close the umbrella yep. and what would instantly happen to you? All the water, all the rain yep. would come pouring down on you. Yep. It was just a little tiny design flaw. Better umbrella. That's right. Came in and said, what if we do it inside out? It closed upwards and captured all of the rain in the water so that it doesn't dump all over you. Yep. This is a two pack. It is the compact size, which means put this in your, look it. Yep. Right there, genius. Right there going in the door. Changed the game. Changed the game and you're getting two in the black. So put this in the car, put this in your bag, put it in your gym bag, leave one at work, wherever it is for $21.99. It's a one hand operation because there's just a little button. You'll see it goes up and down, mm -hmm. so open and close, so it's yep. easy, right? And there we go. And it comes with like a little sleeve that's in there as well. And it comes with a wrist strap so you can carry this around. Everything's on five flex, so $4.40 to get a two pack one maybe in the house yep. one in the office one in the car wherever you want to take it but just a <laughs> slight design flaw chad what with the original umbrella yeah oh the original umbrella I'm like this one we, yes. we, we've engineered this one this yeah. is the new 2023 technology yeah so you saw the big one how it is inverted open and closing the same thing applies yeah. here it's just easier to show you on the big one so um, let me start from the beginning. It's gonna come to you actually just like this in, yeah. in a sleeve. It's gonna be all compact, nice in a sleeve. So you have that if you wanna throw it in your purse, anything like that. Now I'm gonna keep this one um, nice because I have this one ready to go. There's one button operation, auto open and auto close. So I press it just one time, this, this up and down with that wrist strap and all that right there. But I press this button, it pops right open, open and close. Now, there's no metal underworking, right? It's all in between two layers of fabric. So there's two layers of fabric with all the metal in between, so I'm not catching my hair. Uh, and then as I go to close it, I just press the button one more time. It automatically closed, but do you notice how the divots go the opposite yep. way of what a traditional umbrella would close? What does that mean? That means the water, because there's two layers of fabric, only the top layer of fabric will be wet. So as I go to grab this, and I go to close this down, and I go to throw it in my purse or my car or my handbag, something like that, the water is in, there's only gonna be a few raindrops. I mean, you're talking one second. And then the few little raindrops that are in there would be on the inside. And so the fabric that goes against you or goes against your car is always gonna be dry. If you wanna hang it up when you get it home, on a hook by your front door, you can do that. A nice bungee cord here for your wrist as well, in case it is windy, but guess what? Durable up to 30. Yep. 38 mile per hour winds. In some countries, that's considered a hurricane. Right. I mean, quite frankly, 38 right. mile per hour winds. In Canada, that is considered a hurricane. I mean, that was also a design flaw, maybe, of yeah. the first one. What did you say? What year was the umbrella invented, uh, Rob? Oh, do they? 3,500 years ago is when it was invented. So I don't think the inventor is <laughs> watching me this morning. Uh, so he's okay. It's okay 35. for me to say that the original umbrella. Wow. And we've seen those, right, where the wind hits it and it like. It just tulips it, out. Right? It's called tuliping. It, it gone. Basically just shatters, mm -hmm. right? It just, you see all the little wires and everything. Two-ply yeah. fabrication. So think about this. Um, are you going to an amusement park? Bingo. Are you golfing? Are you going to a concert? Are you going to a festival? Are you yeah. doing something? And you want an umbrella. Maybe you see in the forecast, you know, something's coming. Or even from the sun. Sun, yeah. Right? You want just a little shade from the sun. It is a two pack that you're getting. And it's, we say compact. It's just the, the original bed umbrella is like humongous. Oh, it's gigantic. It, it, you can't fit it in your purse. Right. It's great. We sell, we've sold yep. millions of them. But this one is the one you all asked for. After a couple of years of selling the big size, you said, 
okay, I get it, but can I make that for my purse? For my purse. For my glove compartment? Yes. For my RV? And by the way, you're getting two. Yes. This is, um, we sell one in the stores for this price. For the same price. Yeah, for the same if price. If you've seen it out and about, yes. first off, don't get that one. Get the two pack <laughs> here because you always need an umbrella at the time, you know, if you just have one, wherever you're not with the umbrellas when it starts raining. So one in the gym bag, one in your house, one in your car, one in, uh, you know, your purse, where, wherever it happens to be, or keep one gift one. Um, my parents, they're big golfers, so they keep theirs in their golf bag, oh, yeah. just in case. Um, so $21.99 on a flex pay, it's $4.40. When we just say better umbrella here at HSN, Everyone goes, yes, I'm, I'm gonna make a phone call, I'm gonna grab mine because it's, it, we all need it. Yeah. It doesn't matter what part of the country you live in, it doesn't matter what you do, you go outside, right? And right now, Rain, I would use it for- Sleet, snow, sun. Sun. You name, name it, two layers of fabric, gotta be better than one layer of fabric, right? When you're talking about it's sun- It's gotta be better than one. When you're talking about sun protection, I mean, you know, do you ever open your umbrella and it's one layer of fabric and you can still see the sky yeah. through that one layer of fabric? Not with this one, it's two layers. If I can see if I can get my hand in between here. It's two layers of fabric and then all the metal under working, it's all in between that. So you're never catching your hairdo if you're getting really <gasps> yes. tight. You know how it always catches your hair? I can rub this all against my hair. I'm not gonna <laughs> catch it in, inside of there. And then take a look at this technology here. Two layers of fabric as we just talked about, but good for up to 38 mile per hour winds. This is the compact you're seeing right here in the video. It fits into a purse, into a handbag, into anything like that, one button. I love that, that button. That means it's one-handed. Yep. And so as you're carrying the groceries, let me just yep. close it down. As you're getting out of the car and carrying the groceries, trying to get in the house, and you're like, oh, it's raining. Boom. Boom. It's open. It's open. <laughs> and then you go to get inside, you're like, oh, it's closed. But do you see yeah. how this closes this way instead of yeah. closing this way? Mm -hmm. it's, it's just the slightest thing that somebody went, why don't we close it the other direction and capture the water instead of dumping the water all on top of us into our car when you walk into like a business or something and you close it and the water goes goosh all over your shoes, yeah. all of that. Let's capture it. That way you can kind of just shake it out and dump it wherever you want the water to go. Very minimal water. But when you're ready, boom. <laughs> One button, I know, did you hear in my ear? Everybody in the control room goes, are you easily amused? Because I was like, open, shut, open, shut. It's like a fancy umbrella. And it's big. Right? But you would normally not get this kind of an no. upgraded design